Hey, this is Judgment with 3DayRespawn.com, and I've got a hardcore team deathmatch on one of the newer maps called Drive-In. And as you noticed, um, I spawned on the projector side, and the other side we call the screen side. And right away, I'm going to go up in this food court place because I know this is a popular place for people to come to. And I'm not exactly looking for people to shoot from here. I'm just kind of waiting for them to come here. And once they do, I'm going to kill them and then move on. So I'm expecting them to come right from there. And um, they also might come through the middle. You don't want to go through the middle on this map. It's just easy to get killed. So I hear a grenade go off. And sure enough, there he is. And he flashed me, but I was able to get him. Now, um, I'm not going to stay there because I know then they're going to be looking at me, looking for me. So I'm going to move into their spawn. And whenever you move into the spawn, you want to come from one of the flanks, either this side or the other side. All right, now, so I'm in their spawn right now. And the reason, like, I don't want to go into their spawn right away is because usually there's people back here waiting for you to come. Just like the guy behind me, he's in second chance because this guy was waiting for him. And I killed him. I'm just going to look at the area make sure there's nobody else there. And then I'm going to go pick him up. Um, now, I'm not playing with anybody that I know. But I always like to be a good team player and, and help people out. And they're going to, in return, when you do that, help you out. So make sure when you're playing with randoms, you know, help them out. Now, this group of people that I'm playing with um, are really good guys. And I played against them and with them. And when they won or when they lost, they were very um, good about it. You know, they congratulated everybody, said good job. You know, it's just really good playing with these group of guys. Normally there's a lot of um, fighting and name calling and whatnot going on. Now, I want to get back to the right area. And I was going to try and go around the building, but I remembered that you couldn't go that way. There's not an opening back there. So I'm going to have to come through this doorway. And there's some guys just sitting there and waiting. And um, this team that we're playing, there's a lot of people that like to hold an area. So I know that uh, I'm going to have some issues with that. And I'm trying to figure out how to get over there without going through that door. Oh, there we go. And I'm able to pick them off. Uh, so I'm going to jump down here instead of going down the stairs. And before you jump or before you move, just make sure you check your corners and, and watch that and whatnot. I'm going to see where this guy's going. Oh, and I catch a guy there. And I want to move through here because I know there's still a guy back there. There he is. All right, so now I got my favorite sniper rifle. That's the M16 silenced with a red dot. Uh, once in a while, I'll put an ACOG on there. I don't use sniper rifles. Um, in hardcore, the M16 is just a beast. And you can run and gun with it, and also you can pick people off long distance with it. Um, the FAL and the M14, those are good guns too, but this fires a three-round burst. And it just helps you um, hit people and take them down, especially if they're running and whatnot. Um, so good gun to use. I never liked it. Um, this one guy I played with who does really well always used it and so you know, I decided to give it a try and sure enough I really started liking it. Now I'm going to pick up this uh, Glio just because I've been using the other gun a lot and I'm probably running low on ammo. So, But if you haven't used the M16 try it out. I, I know it doesn't sound like a good gun to use for a lot of people but it is a really good gun to use. Alright so now I'm back in their spawn, their original spawn. And just kind of looking around just to see and make sure that there's nobody back there. And I think I missed a guy back there. Um, but you don't want to go through the middle. I'm going to go up here and get a good bird's eye view. This is the best sniper spot. Um, it's better than the other side. You get a really good view and there's a lot of people that come through the middle and you can just pick them off. So um, I tend to stay there sometimes and try to do that. And <laughs> I get picked off though. And there there was, you know, I got shot from the guy on the food court. And um, like I said, that is a very popular spot to go to. Now I got my chopper gunner and so I'm going to go back here and call it in. I don't think I get one kill with this. And I sped it up. Uh, there I'm 11 to 1. This team that I'm playing, they uh, took out both my chopper gunner and my helicopter pretty fast. And I, I think I may have gotten a kill or two with the regular attack helicopter. But there, I'm going down already. Um, and I like to run with Estrella on my back and pretty much all my classes just in case somebody calls something in. So it's not surprising uh, when you get taken down right away. Now I think I'm running Hardline. That's probably my favorite first perk. Um, that and Ghost. But I normally run hardline until people start calling stuff in. And I've got usually a Law or a Strella in there. I thought that was a guy just laying there. But, oh, there's a guy. And somehow I missed him. Ends up taking me out. But uh, there again, you see that place is popular. Okay, so now I, f I spawned on the other flank. 
and I'm going to come up um, from the other way and I'm just looking back there to see if there's anybody back there um, and I'm going to go up here and uh, again look through there. Now I'm going to check the food court out first and see if there's anybody up there. I don't see anybody. Then I'm going to look. Oh, but I see some shots coming out of there. And I'm going to wait for them. And somehow I managed to kill them. It's weird. Sometimes, like right there, I'm on somebody. Or it looks like I'm on somebody and I don't drop them. And then sometimes I'm not even close to somebody and I drop them. You know, the lag in this game uh, just makes things look a little bit funny. All right, now I see a red dot and I'm getting shot at. And that red dot's coming up there, I'm sure somebody said. It's probably somebody I killed or somebody got And there he came over the, up the other ladder and got me. Now, I, I like how Treyarch does this. and They always put, you know, two ladders or two openings to every spot. So you can't just cover them with a... Um, and there goes my helicopter, I think. But they always have two openings, so you can't just cover them with your claymores. And you got to be really careful and really helps get at campers and whatnot. Here I do the cardinal sin of going through the middle. You never want to do that. And I get taken down. The middle is just a death zone for people, you know, watching that middle area. Constantly. So you want to be careful with that. Now, once again, I spawn on the screen side, and they are holding that other area. And uh, my teammates are telling me that, you know, every time they go in there, they're just getting taken out. So instead of pushing that and going towards them, I'm going to just try and work this area and try and take them out. Standing by. Now this match is coming to an end, so I just want to use this opportunity to tell you about 3dayrespawn.com. Uh, make sure you come out and check out the website. It's a great uh, place to meet people Enemy playing, um, especially if you're a follower of Christ and you're looking for other people to play that share that same view. And even if you're not, um, they're just a good bunch of people out Watch there. The and it's not just Call of Duty. There's groups for Enemy all games all that you play. And it's not just for guys. There, there's a group of girls that play Call of Duty, and um, you know, there's somebody, something there for everybody. So make sure you check out 3DayRespawn.com, and when you sign up, make sure you look for me and send me a friend request. I just go by Judgment there, not Judgment Awaits or anything like that. Um, but I'd love to talk to you and get to know you and whatnot. Ah, and I get shot and put into Second Chance, and I'm speeding this up because you don't need to see it. But uh, I, I think I get picked up, and, um, you know, I think it's part of that goodwill that you make. You know, when you pick somebody else up, somebody else is going to pick you up. Um, like I said, I was just playing with a good good bunch of people, and, you know, I, I always try to try to play with respect, and, and hopefully, you know, people in turn will do that back. But there it is, 7,500, 3,800. And they ended up uh, 22 and 4. So, but I hope you like this. I'm gonna be putting up some more gameplay videos. And always, though, uh, take care and God bless, guys.